What's up guys, my name is Ace, and it's time to take a look at the footstep sounds in COD World War II. We're going to be comparing what footsteps sound like and what kind of distances we can hear enemy footsteps at. Then we're also going to be looking at the inconspicuous basic training skill, as well as the Mountain Division perk 4, which makes your footsteps silent. Keep in mind with this video, if you have some headphones, I'd highly recommend using them, or at least turn your speakers up a bit, because I am actually going to be showing off clips where you have to listen for these footsteps. Just a quick note about the gameplay, this is in fact my gameplay, I'm on my girlfriend's account here, we're trying to get her rank up in ranked play so that she can end up playing with me because the MMR difference was a little bit too high, so this is my gameplay and I just wanted to answer that before I get all the questions about it. So the way I decided to approach this video is first up we're going to be looking at footstep sounds for you, for yourself, if you're running these perks or if you're not running these perks in this game. Then a little bit later we'll be looking at what it sounds like when enemies are using these perks versus not using these perks, and what sort of ranges we can hear their footsteps at. So first up, let's look at sprinting. I'm going to be showing you guys three clips consecutively here. The first clip is going to be with no perks whatsoever, so no mountain division and no inconspicuous. The second clip is going to be with the inconspicuous basic training skill. And the final clip is going to be with the mountain division once it's leveled up to that tier 4. So here we go, pay close attention to the sound. Alright, so as you can tell, not really any surprises here. Without perks, your footsteps are quite loud, and that's definitely going to affect your ability to hear other players, and obviously other players are going to be able to hear you pretty easily. With Inconspicuous, it doesn't completely silent your footsteps, but it does make them definitely quieter, which will help a little bit with your awareness and make it a bit more difficult for enemies to hear you. And then finally, with Mountain Division while sprinting, you make no footstep sounds whatsoever. Next up we're going to have a look at walking. Now walking in this game is defined as your character is still standing and you're moving as fast as you can without activating sprint. With this one I decided to just eliminate the mountain division. Just know with the mountain division you make absolutely no footstep sounds whatsoever so I felt like it was kind of pointless to keep tacking it on to the end here when you're just not going to hear anything. So this time we're going to be playing two clips. First clip is with no perks and the second clip is with inconspicuous. So this one might have surprised you a little bit, it did surprise me slightly. With Inconspicuous, you make no footstep sounds whatsoever unless you're sprinting. So if you're walking around the map, you are completely silent just as though you had the Mountain Division. This is very important to know because if you're using Inconspicuous in something like Search and Destroy for instance, let's just say you don't happen to have a Mountain class but you have an Inconspicuous one, your enemies will be able to hear you when you're sprinting, but the moment you start walking around the map, you will be dead silent. Now the last test we're going to be showing from my perspective here, where you're listening to your own footsteps, is going to be well crouched. You're probably not going to be too surprised by the sound of the footsteps here, but I want you to also pay attention to the movement speed between these two tests. Once again, first clip is going to be with no perks, and the second clip will be with inconspicuous. So as you can see there, if you've got none of these perks to reduce your footstep sounds, your best bet is going to be crouch walking around the map, although you still will be making footstep sounds. But once again, with Inconspicuous, you make no footstep sounds whatsoever while crouched. This is no surprise, because obviously if you don't make any footstep sounds while walking, you're not going to be making any while crouched. And also you probably noticed the movement speed was noticeably faster with Inconspicuous. I did the tests and the calculations on this. Your movement speed while crouched is increased by 20% with Inconspicuous. This is still a little bit slower than walking around the map, but it's actually pretty close to the standard walking speed. So that's what it sounds like with your own footsteps. Now let's have a listen to enemy footsteps. I think this is the part that a lot of you guys are here for. At what distances can you hear the enemy's footsteps? And just how loud are footsteps in this game? The first test for this one is once again going to be a sprint test. Pay close attention to when you can start hearing the first footstep. And once again, it's going to be starting off with no perks. The second clip is going to be inconspicuous. And the third clip is going to be mountain. So it's pretty clear there, you can actually hear enemies from a good distance away, assuming there's not a lot of gunfire and stuff going on, which in a lot of respawn game modes, of course you're going to be having that. 
With Inconspicuous, the distance that you hear that first footstep is a little bit closer, but it's still a pretty decent distance away. But obviously the volume of those footsteps is significantly reduced, so therefore that will throw enemies off a lot if they're trying to sound whore you. And then finally, of course, with the Mountain Division, you can't hear any footsteps whatsoever, even when sprinting. So once again, for the rest of these tests, we're just going to eliminate the Mountain Division. The next thing I wanted to show you is still with your enemy sprinting, but this is more so just to get an indication of the volume of the enemy footsteps when they're running in proximity to you. The first clip is going to be with no perks, and the second clip is with Inconspicuous. So as you can tell, even though they can still hear your footsteps with Inconspicuous when you're at a full sprint, this does help you a lot, especially in a lot of respawn game modes. I'm thinking like Capture the Flag or something like that where you might want to be sneaky sometimes, but then other times you want that mobility of the Airborne Division for instance. Inconspicuous can definitely help and it will throw off people that are actively trying to sound whore you. They'll think you're either a lot further away or they just won't hear your footsteps in time before you already have the jump on them. Now for the next test, we're moving on to walking. Once again, first clip is going to be with no perks and the second clip is with Inconspicuous. So if your enemy isn't using any sound reduction perks, you can still hear them walking from a very good distance away if you're really paying attention and there's not a lot of noise on the map. Once again though, no surprise with Inconspicuous, you make absolutely no footstep sounds whatsoever, they can be walking right in front of you and you won't hear anything from them. So finally, just to give you a little bit of a gauge of the footstep sounds with no perks, let's now have a look at the crouch test. With this one, I decided to just eliminate Inconspicuous. You don't make any footstep sounds whatsoever. I think I've already proved that. But have a listen and see just how far away you can hear somebody that's crouching without these perks. Once again, pretty surprising to see just how far away somebody can hear you if you don't have these perks and you're crouch walking around. Also, as they get closer, the volume of their footsteps is very audible. So, like I said earlier, it's the best way to get around the map if you're trying to be quiet without these perks, but it's still very possible that the enemy is going to pick up on your footstep sounds. So one last little tip that I wanted to point out for you guys, and this is something I've been getting a lot. I've had a few people ask me, I'm using the Mountain Division in Search and Destroy, and somehow the enemies just seem to hear me. You look at the kill cam, and it's clear that it's like they heard you. One thing I wanted to point out that I think a lot of people haven't caught on to yet is the fact that you still make other sounds when you're using the Mountain Division or Inconspicuous. Basically, all the time, you're still making other sounds. And the biggest thing that's going to give you away in Search and Destroy is either reloading your weapon or swapping your weapon. I've seen a lot of people using that YY technique just, just when they're bored or something and they're trying to kill some time. And that actually makes a lot of sound. In this last clip I'm going to play for you guys, the enemy is using the Mountain Division, so I can't hear their footsteps at all. But just have a listen to how audible it is when they're switching their weapon back and forth. So just know, when you're playing Search and Destroy, anytime you're swapping your weapon or reloading, there is a chance that an enemy will pick up on that. And with that, we're going to wrap up today's video on the footstep sounds in COD World War II. I'd like to know in the comment section below, did anything here surprise you guys? Like I said earlier, I was pretty surprised that you're completely silent with Inconspicuous when you're walking around the map. I thought you had to be crouched to get those silent footsteps. Turns out, that's not the case. If you enjoyed the video, a like rating is always appreciated, and don't forget to subscribe for more if you haven't already. I'll talk to you guys next time.